Welcome to the Star Wars Galaxy. Here you can see planets from Coruscant down to Kamino, each siding with one of the main factions at war, the Republic and the Separatists. Two commanders lead their respective sides. Commander Rooster controls the Republic, while the evil Dave is in charge of the Separatists. Each commander has his strengths and weaknesses, with Rooster, our main protagonist, focusing on canon-accurate fleet compositions. These include four different tiers that will be loosely followed and potentially adjusted throughout the campaign. Meanwhile, Dave, the enemy, will throw every everything he has at Rooster, including hundreds of ships at a time. It is our objective to ensure Rooster gets the upper hand and wins a losing battle. Will he do it? Let's find out. Yes. Welcome to the Forces of Corruption Clone Wars submod, which merges Republic at War and Clone Wars 4.0. So we can see we've got quite an assortment of units, which will be fun to play around with. Like all good players, we are going to first invest in... Um, in casinos, yeah. Yeah, like every smart person, we're going to invest in casinos. What we want to do is start pouring money into our foundation. We want to make sure that we have a good income. Just like every successful person in the world, you want to make sure that you got money before you pull the big moves. Rothana, we're probably going to want to reserve that for our vehicle production but Bespin. Bespin is where the big dinero is and Bespin is going to be a fun one because this is going to require a defense. Right off the bat we are going to need to make sure we defend. Now with most Clone Wars uh, in the TV show most defenses are pretty sparse you know this is kind of the extent. Now in the game that's not gonna fly that well or at least it's not going to start out as well. We are going to try to be, do things that are a little bit more canon, right? So I don't want to just spam clone platoons. Rather, perhaps we're going to have a speeder bike and perhaps a field commander throughout this entire base of operations. Moreover, I could add a ton of ships to bolster this Venator fleet, but in reality, that's probably not going to be the case. And honestly, uh, because it is cut off from the other planets that I do have, I would actually prefer to pull this Venator back once we do lose the space operations on Bespin. Just kind of have it retreat to wherever. We're going to let time go for a little bit. And we are going to actually make our first assault. Surely I've got a little bit more dinero here. Let me, uh, let me throw in on the backwater planets. I actually would presume Dantooine is in a little bit of trouble because my Guido Immunalist are here. We've got we can turn on all of these boys. We've got some pretty heavy hitters, actually. My Guido is great for income. Mutalist is like a separatist outpost, or a separatist base, essentially. It's a little bit more canon. So each Jedi is going to have his own fleet. However, with certain cases, like Anakin and Ahsoka, they're going to be paired together because that's kind of how they operated in the Clone Wars. Sometimes Anakin and, uh, and Obi-Wan will also work together, and sometimes in the greatest of sieges, we'll have all the Jedi kind of stick together. Besides that, I think my eyes are on Frisia. We're gonna go with a, a typical, a standard fleet composition. Again, not following the bracket too heavily, but we are going to try to make this pretty consistent. I am going to pour in one leader. We're gonna go with Anakin on this one. I'm gonna steal two acclimators to provide support for this fleet. And this kind of looks like a typical Clone Wars fleet composition. Let's, go. Let's move. Jax. Construction complete. Uh. Excuse me. All right, off to a good start. Uh. Okay. It appears to me. Uh, let's get some research. It appears to me that Frisia does not even have a space station. So because of that, it's time to commence assault. Within most of the Clone Wars episodes, it's just like a simple like platoon or two plus a little bit of light walker reinforcements or potentially heavy walkers such as ATTEs. I don't think I can invest in ATTEs at the moment, so we are gonna stick to just a platoon. Usually a Z90, a couple Z96s will be in there and some Plex soldiers. Kashyyyk, you are glorious. You're probably doomed. Um, We probably want armor. Let's do it here. Because armor, we can use these facilities to defend, I believe, to defend against attackers. It's not probably the best strategy in the world. But yeah, here comes our tech. Of course, we are going to upgrade that as quick as possible. And bada bing, bada boom. Look, see, our, our money is fantastic. So what I'm going to do is invest in our infrastructure as well. 
All right. Looks like we're getting boots on the ground. Let's go. Okay. That's a great start. Uh. All right. <laughs> okay. We're gonna do something a little dashing, a little bit daring. We're going to use our standard fleet, and we are going to attack this planet, Forost. Allows production of capital ships. Oh, we are dead. Let's go. Copy that. Tactical battle imminent. Is that a bulwark? Oh, I got this. I got this. Uh, so it allows the production of capital ships, things that we are in short supply of, matter of fact. So don't worry. Impressive. Don't worry. This will this will be uh this will yeah Intel exactly. Could be as much as a full battalion of droids down there. It's gonna be a tough job to dig them all out. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's, let's, uh, go. let's check out the enemy. Here they come. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Not bad, not bad. So we've got a big bulwark Mark One, large battle cruiser with heavy firepower, low fighter complement. That's what I like to hear. Because our capital ship, the Venator, is known for its massive fighter complement. So what we're going to do is be a little cheesy, a little cheesy breezy, and we are going to send in our lovely Venators. Try to ambush this guy. Is it risky? Yes. Is it stupid? Potentially. But we're going to try it out. Jedi don't seek adventure. Patience. Okay. Try to take out these bombers if you can, senor. And while we're at it, I do see a number of fighters. We're going to try to keep our skies clear. Look at that. Anakin's going to try to... This looks like a pretty standard fleet for the Republic. Absolutely beautiful. And fantastic. Now, it would be wise for me to start sending in my fighters, so I will recommend the bombers go... Yes, we do. Recommend the bombers to pursue. Okay, how do I? Okay. By holding control, I can grab all of the big ships that I need, and I am going to have them pull into formation here. It's important I get them into the battle here. This is Space Station Level Three. Medium-sized attack forces, otherwise known as ours. Anakin is a fantastic anti-fighter um, Jedi. Actually, all the Jedis are really like that. So, because of that, it's important to take advantage of his skill set. And as you can tell, we've got a ton of enemy vessels here. So it's important that we try to pin down these munificence. These guys are like our DPSs, I think, are what they're called. They they focus on damage. They can do a lot of chaos. They can cause a lot of problems. So because of that, we want to make sure that we take out the guys who do a lot of damage. Moreover, this guy, the Bulwark, is probably going to be, right, a battle cruiser, heavy firepower. It's going to be like a tank. So it's going to do, it's going to take a lot of damage. So we want to watch out. We've got multiple players on the game, on the, on the chessboard here. We've got to be careful. You can see that this guy's shields are getting shredded, for instance. So because of that, he might not make it. That's all right, though. We'll take this one out. Yes, and you, I want you to focus on this one. We're going to try to take out that heavy turbo Yeah, likely not going to take them out, so I'll use whatever guns you have, man, and then we'll uh, set you on your way. Adios. <laughs> Adios on that ship. All right. I'm going to send in my, my bombers over. Them out. Look at that point defense. Fantastic. We are doing brilliantly right now. We've got bombers in the fray. Now we do have a little bit of an issue. We do have a little bit of an issue, and that would include these guys. These guys are point defense frigates. They're gonna take out my fighters like butter. We also have an issue. Oh no. <laughs> we have an issue. Um. Yeah, so my Venator is dying. Okay. If this is a standard, if this is our standard fleet, we need to be able to defeat these guys. And I think I went a little bit too forward on this, but as a famous engineer once said, 
if you fail the first time, yes, don't fail the second, you know what I mean? <laughs> We do have the fighter advantage, but that doesn't give us much when we don't have many bombers. Big issue. Now, I am going to take advantage of the tiny reinforcement count that I do have, which won't do much, but will definitely enable me to kind of pop off. So I'm going to use, since this vendor is, is really taking an L, I'm going to use this one. To go around and flank. We can have. Let's see if we can get guns on him. No. No, no, no. I want you to focus fire on this guy. Everyone has to focus fire on this friend. Time. I want all these guys on here. It's not gonna they're not gonna do much, but their light arms fire will be able to puncture that arm. That armor. There we go. Okay. And I can run that one. Okay. I lost that editor. Let's see what I can do here. Now we've got another problem on the field. This player right here. Again, he's easy to kill on his own, but the issue is that he's not on his own. He's got this big boy space station. So you really got to try to take him out. Again, fighters on his own. Perfect. We need to start melting them with light arms fire. There we go. Okay. Switch targets. I believe these consular classes have missile arrays, so we're going to use them for the shields, while my acclimator is also on this guy. Meanwhile, you're going for it. Now you have a, you have a big boy laser on this, I think. So once we start shredding this guy, amazing grace. Immediately. Come on, you have to start shredding this thing down. The fellas need to start fighting on the uh, on the space station soon here. There we go. They'll fight to the last droid if it means taking a few more of us with them. We, I agree. We need to take out that shield. Oh, brother, this is gonna be close. Gotta protect the fighters. Protect those fighters. Good stuff, brother. Bear. Well done. We got a bomber group. Not as useful. Okay. We gotta need to start pulling off fighters to protect the bombers. Good job. Good job. Focus on the turbo lasers, that's what's gonna try to take out our Venator here. Okay, you're making your run, fellas. Look at these little <laughs> these little guys are gonna Oh man, they're doing so well. Got some bombers on here, got a bada bing, gotta take those ones out. This guy's gotta use them. Here come our bombers. Not in the traditional yellow, a little bit reddish, but I dig it. Gotta do a little spinny spin. Nice job, buddy. Okay. Good job, Anakin. So this is why the cannon design of having... Oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. Okay, we need to take out those concussions. Where the heck? There we go. I'm going to diversify our targets here. I don't want them to waste their missiles on something that's already dead. Ooh, this is a close one, my god. Oh, mayonnaise, this is... 
Well, this is quite the party. That's right. Obi Wan ain't here though, so watch out who you're referring to. Look at like this. This is quite Gucci, I must say. Alright. Good job. Good position. Let's get a move on. What are you doing? What are you doing? Trying to get all your guns in there? <laughs> What's going on here? Anyway, yes. Congratulations. Our first victory. We did lose, oh god, quite a bit, but do not worry. They also did. Let's take the ground now. So Anakin totally took an L on this fleet, but don't worry. We're about to take a W. Invasion commencing. We're dead. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, oh, Rex is here. Oh. Hey, what's up, man? Oh, that's that's pretty, bruh. <laughs> man, right, that's a pretty good run right there. All right, it looks like looks like Rex is gonna be he's gonna be t posing with us. All right, <laughs> we're gonna start off pretty conservative on our our troop composition. We're gonna have a couple gunners, pluck soldiers, and our uh, platoon. Let's we'll see what we can do there, and oh my god, I've got locals. Perfect. Now locals usually will have defenses, um, they're so dead, but they usually have defenses up. So I will gladly uh, assist them in that case. Yes, you can. Make sure that these guys don't, uh, don't, don't, get, don't get the advantage. So these guys are pretty much boned, um, or not. Uh, okay, uh, right. We know that there are quite a few clankers out here. At least the ones that are scouting. Which means, because of that, we'll be able to figure out the other jabs. Alright, look at that. Let's go. Got our troops, we've got our squads. Now I remember in the old Clone Wars mod, these were original. Wow, that is just so funny looking. These clones were originally packed um, just as, not as squads, so you can use them individually, just like how you see these C6 rotary cannon troops. But it seems like in this new update, we just have them in squads, which is cool. That's very interesting. I actually didn't know this was updated that recently. Uh, you, but I am. Very excited to try this out. <laughs> Alright. I love the run. Besides Rexus, that's... <laughs> but the clones running, it, it, does, it is pretty reminiscent of the show. Uh, and it does look very cool. As you can see, uh, these fellas are doomed. <laughs> oh, sorry. Don't worry, guys. Take two. Need any assistance? Yeah, the the um, the locals are not usually very effective. They, they die. Where should I go? But I think the homies got one kill, so not bad. Well done, guys. Let's try to drop off one more uh, one more squad of you. Meanwhile, I'm gonna send them into the fray, kind of. Oh, like this one right here. Here we go. Contact. No, oh, not like that. We got contact. So this is where I'm going to start getting a little ballsy. I actually don't want to drop troops off there. I don't want to get... I don't want to get ambushed. So I'm going to send in my ATRTs down here. And then now that I have sight on these droids, I'm going to move the ATRTs up. Meanwhile, moving these troops up. I'm doing an attack move, which is why it's red. That allows me to make sure that if I'm not looking... I know that they're gonna fight on their own. It's pretty solid. Oh my god, that is so sad. That was a terrible sight. All right, here we go. Focus on the B ones. 
These are the the puny clankers. <laughs> These are the ones that don't have much health, and they're they're pretty funny. Like me. Impressive. All right, looks like we got contact. All right, form up, right here. Reinforcement point contested. God, that is that is rad. You can't negotiate with droids. No one can stop us. Okay, so they're just going to engage. Fine. This battle isn't over until we've scrapped the last clanker. I want to start engaging here too. Losing is not an option. I'm gonna open up a second front on this battlefield. Right away. Moving ahead. Never Using the ATRTs, which are, I, I think, traditionally uh, anti-infantry. Using the wrong character model, I guess, but they're anti-infantry. Copy that. I'm gonna use them to punch a hole on the right. Anakin's gonna tank the the left. What the heck is going on here? What are you guys doing? <laughs> There's missed out on this whole squad here. One shot, one kill. Roger that fast. Right. Just like in basic training. What is that? Ah, perfect. That's what I like to see. What are your orders? Yes, General. Copy that. Pull off the flex soldiers. I'm gonna go Let's grab this satellite. So this satellite, what it's gonna do is it's going to allow us to see the entire field. You notice that there's a little bit of fog around here. Like here, I can't see any troop movements. By unlocking this, I'll be able to see exactly what's going on. Oh my god, we got a problem. We got a problem here. We got a tank. <laughs> Our troops. Head down, open fire. Rex has a grenade, and you are Plex soldiers, I, I should, should not have sent them out. Okay, it's alright. That is all Gucci here. Oh, this is good, this will be fun. We're ready for battle, sir. These Move guys up, seem man. to be lagging behind, but we'll, we'll get them in the battle, don't worry. Alright, Jedi. Bombs prime. Oh, who did that? Would you look at that? I uh, just sent it a bombing run. All right. Let's, uh, let's see. We've lost a build pad. All right. Watch the rear. These guys have a death wish, so I'm going right to. I'm going to give it to them. Send over our ATRTs and, uh, bruh. And take them out. Copy that, General. All right. We're going to start making our push there. Kind of, oh my gosh, that's a turbo laser. Okay, okay, I, we've been getting picked up, haven't we? Pull back. Oh, I'm sure you can. Oh, don't kill our Plex soldiers, why? Alright, pull everybody back. Ah, that poor guy. He's getting sniped down this entire time. Okay. Since we have the locals, we're going to use them as fodder. Sorry. And we're going to push. You can see this guy has quite a bit of range. Oh, are, are you serious? Oh my gosh, for real? We got four seconds. Move, move, move. We got four seconds, fellas. Get in there. <laughs> and there we go. That's our first planet victory. Building under bada bing bada boom. So as you can see, pretty simple, pretty quirky, and pretty fantastic. So we're gonna let the tech go through, and we've got some a lot of new heroes. <laughs> All right, I'll check them out in a second. What do we got here? We've got a stealth ship. Oh, that's from the season two Clone Wars episode. All right, so as you can see here, we got our first fleet commander, oh, Admiral. We're gonna and oh no. And here comes the Doom Fleet. Okay. So, like I said in this game, they love to stack their fleets, and it really is a numbers game. I don't think I can win this, but I sure as heck can hurt them a little bit. In terms of defense of this planet, I don't think we're going to be able to perform it. We do have the money, but I don't think it'd be fun. So, let's see what we got here. Let's see what I can do. I do kind of sound like a, like an academic sometimes, I apologize. I'm just kind of uh, telling you my thought process here. 
So we are going to try to invest in as much of a fleet composition as possible. Also, quick strategy. You can figure out how close your ships are to the enemy. For instance, this guy is a little bit too close. So you want him to pull back to be supported by our turrets. Look at that, see? Beautiful. And then we're going to get a second off. Magna Guards. It's those Magna Guard ships. Wow. Now that is quirky. Constructing. I don't know why did I get a laser defense. We're not going to have trouble with fighters too much, actually. It, we're going to have trouble with the capital ships. Or the munificence, actually. Those guys are going to... That's a lot of DPS. Like I said, those fellas are focused on damage. They're kind of glass cannons or whatever that term is. Right? Meaning they, they don't really last long. But they surely, surely will perform some damage. They've got a big cannon. Seems like we're getting some activity over here. So, I'll keep that in mind. Here comes our next supply of ships. I kind of want to make this as even as possible. I don't want to, you know, cheat it too much because as you can tell, I've got quite the assortment of dinero. But I am trying to see if I can slow these guys down because this is so incredibly ooey gooey unfair. <laughs> so here we go. I'm not going to do too much microing here, but here's our assortment of ships. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my gosh. Fellas, we're getting flanked. Terribly. I love it. If you've noticed, sometimes the uh, lasers will be deflected. That's beautiful. That's such a cool effect. My goodness. And all of these guys, look at this. They're getting shredded. Absolutely shredded right now. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even notice these guys were here. Glad to help, you guys. Or glad to have your help. Would have been nice if you were there like 10 seconds ago. My friends, I think we, <laughs> we need these reinforcements. There we go. Look at that. Now we're Gucci. This is what I'm talking about. Some real tanks. You can see how powerful these Venators are because they took out that one. He's about to take out this, this, and that. Like, come on now. That's beautiful. We've got a... What the heck? We got a victory? I'm so sorry. This is totally not canon. <laughs> this feels very inappropriate to have at this, this time. It's a little early. But, um... Yeah, the Republic just got stacked. It's, turns out Abrogado Ray was just a really important planet for them. So, yeah, this won't happen again. Apologies. But yeah, I, this, it's kind of fun. <laughs> this is pretty quirky. Alright. No, it didn't. We're, we're kind of close to winning, actually. I'll let them take out the uh, space station, though. You got this. You got this. Come on, guys. I trust you. Boom, 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 boom. You know? Boom. Space station down. Look at that. Now let's see. Can this fleet take on the remains of this? The answer is probably yes. But they're surely going to take a few of us with them. Now, because this is kind of cheating, I'm actually going to retreat. I think they earned this win. I think they earned the victory. But I surely will, will take their losses. <laughs> Yeah, these, these poor ship commanders are like, what the heck are you doing? We were winning. What are you doing? 
Um, we were winning. <laughs> oh gosh. Great. We took out a few mun munificence. Um, and we lost a little bit of money, but don't worry. We'll make it back. Pretty easy. Now... Okay, I guess now is the, the fight. Wow, that was pretty impressive. I'm not going to be generous with this one, okay? I do want to put up a little bit of a defense. It seems like we've got a beach. They're going to spearhead... Um, no, we do our job well. Okay, here we go. You can negotiate with oh, crime. Points. Looks like they're not actually attaching, attacking the beach itself. They're already there. Cool. Let's see what we got here. Got our ATPTs. We got troops moving up, moving around. This is good. Oh, but, oh, that's bad. Okay, <laughs> okay, that's bad. We've got a. Uh, we have the locals. The locals don't like us. Fair enough. You know, I I get it. I think it's kind of unfair for them to dislike us. Oh my God, your aim. What is going on there? Stay frosty. On it, sir. Prepare to engage the enemy. Yes, sir. See if we can get some turrets up in this place. Sir, yes, sir. Complete. We're ready for battle, No sir. turrets, no weapon emplacements, no. Watch the rear. Never give. We'll follow you anywhere, sir. Move out! Clones keep the scrap merchants busy. Wow, I'm actually really surprised. We don't have a good defense. This is actually terrible. <laughs> oh my goodness. And the locals are, are actually tough on us. Okay. Oh, you, you'll take your win, honestly. I'm, I'm okay with it, but... Would like to put up a bit of a fight. For sure. Would like to. Oh, Christ. Okay. Oh, Lord. Troops just threw a grenade, I think. Nice, 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 nice. And here comes the army. All right. Now that was a brilliant strategy. Distract us with the locals, pull all our forces out of here, and then throw in their army through the other end. Okay, looks like the speeders don't have any sound, but it's okay. Oh, that was a bad idea, bad idea. All right, homie, you got this. Oh, no, you don't. Alright, yeah. I noticed. Get out of there. Get out of there. By the armor. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Hold your position, troops. Oh, no. Yeah, keep up on that high ground. We got a couple more homies out here. And the fight troops. Okay. There's the big boy. How are we gonna know? What are you doing, sir? Have you lost your mind? What are you doing back there? What the heck are you doing? <laughs> Perfect. We got some more clones. So we do have grenadiers. Whom we can use. Okay, I got a plan. Good plan. Okay, I'm just going to send the armor in. Grenade launcher. 
god. Okay, we're gonna have to get behind these guys. This is not going to work, but at least I can say I tried. Right behind them. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't fight while walking? Okay. You don't have to. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's a four on four. Oh, okay. Here they come. You know, it was a brilliant strategy in theory, um, but in practice, not as much. Honestly, you know, not great. But don't worry, I've got uh, another strategy. Situation untenable. All forces withdrawn. <laughs> oh, I'm a great tactician, aren't I? Oh, there go these fellas. All right, come on, come on. Okay, that's just excessive. Two for two, though. I'll take it. System lost. That I feel great. Look at that. See, we've got Torrent Company. Wood Rex, and then we've got the 501st. So we're going to get Training Torrent Company up and added, and then a couple 501st platoons. And then we won't have to keep, we won't have to continue using our uh, regular Phase 1 clones anymore. Then we can phase them out. Phase. We can phase them out. Give them to our next fleet with Obi-Wan. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, I expected that. Okay. So like I said, I can't get crazy big fleets. It's just something I can't do. So we're just gonna have to get a lot of fleets. They they seem to be doom stacking, which is just a lot of ships in one place, which means that they're taking ships away from other locations. So we're going to make our second fleet here. We're going to have Obi-Wan be the head of it. We already have his buddies over here. You're going to have a pretty state-of-the-art fleet, Obi-Wan. What the? What the heck are you? You're a security droid, huh? Okay, okay. What the heck is this battle? Wonder if Obi Wan's up here. Yes, yes, we do. Okay, we'll get the two twelve. Now, let's fight this battle. Contact. Oh my! Oh my God! I'm so sorry. I don't even know who the heck you guys are. Our position is secure. Roger that, sir. Ah, great. We do our job well. You can't negotiate with droids. A little bit of a... It's, it's kind of cheesy in the game, to be honest, but I'm using the bikes. I'm going to start capturing as many points as I can using our financials. Our incredible financials. To be able to get turrets to slow down the enemy forces. Yeah, I know it's not going to be the greatest, but in the Clone Wars, the clones are very strategic. Let me tell you something. I am also somewhat strategic. Yes, Alright, fellas. Get down there. Nice. I need somewhere to start settling the troops. From what I was able to tell, it's only infantry. So this will be a, a very even fight, actually. Great. Ah. Might actually well, make them retreat. Like, if I saw this and I had those just two squads of droids, yeah, I wouldn't last too long here. But they do have quite a few, so maybe I'm underestimating them. 
maybe they're underestimating me, hey, yo. Can I help? Ready. Complete. Advancing, sir. Construction complete. Our position is secure. Here we go. They're advancing on our territory. Construction complete. What I'm going to do is I'm going to split up. I'm going to split up our forces because if they get here, they're going to kill our guys, and I don't want to lose the battle because of that. Come on now. Come on now. I'm not going to lose the battle because of that. I'm going to keep the speeders out. The heck did they just blow up? Ah, what is this? Uh, nothing. <laughs> Droids are making their advance, it looks like. This battle isn't over until we've scrapped the last clank at your service. Order confirmed. I'm gonna use our um meat shields, pretty much. To just kind of slow down the enemy. Never surrender. One shot, one kill. Ah, wait, oh you're dead. No. Oh brother, we could have dropped a good grenade there. Yes, General. Let's move on. Move out, men. Combat is a yes. clone's natural element. We lost a build pad. Yes, yes, meet shields. Yes, good, 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 good damage. Copy Wait, that, pretty much none, but okay. Firing. Where do you need me? We'll do. Oh, Here we go. Okay, Troids are just taking L's there. Weapons check. Okay. We've secured a build Stay pad. Frosty. Flanking positions. Understood, General. That is not a not a good turret or bomb placement, guys. Over there, how to engage the enemy. Copy that. Construction yes, complete. What's that? Are those the security away, guys? Sir. Those are the security guys. So what's special about you? Great Federation use quite dangerous in great numbers. Okay, okay. That's the same. It. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's kind of the, the same definition. Maybe it's just that they're quirky. It adds some variety. Sir, yes, sir. I don't know. Move out. Right. Good. Keep these guys out of combat for Understood, a second here. Sir. We're ready for battle, sir. I'm here. I'll do my best. Our troops keep holding that position. Watch the rear. Okay, and once our bombs get up and running, I'll be able to do another run. Or or not. Oh okay, okay. I, wow. <laughs> what did I say? We did fantastic. Good job, guys. So this is some sort of outpost. Building Looks like you justified getting yourself a light factory. And you know what? Because it's an out, or because it literally, I said it's an outpost. Building we'll get you that. I'm not going to get you a listening post though, because I don't know what that does. Orkies. Yeah. That place is infested with Wookiees, right? And these guys are... Oh, God, Tatooine is dead. <laughs> yeah, Tatooine is doomed. I forgot how quick this game moves. Like, it's very fast. And not only is it fast, but there's just a lot of just... Oh, hey, how you doing, man? Oh, what's up, tentacles? Requesting assistance. Because it's fast, there's a lot going on. And you just kind of... You gotta keep moving. You gotta keep thinking. Well, in the meantime, we're gonna create a little bit of an interesting fleet. Again, I have to limit myself here, but I am gonna do five dreadnoughts. Oh, this looks like a similar situation to last time. They don't have a lot of ground forces, but they do have a lot in terms of space. We've got droid commandos, droid because, and B1s. I am going to auto resolve. I do not want to spend the time fighting that over. Right now, I'm going to focus on building up two fleets here. Reinforcement available. That is a problem. Tech upgrade in progress. We still can't make Venators. Oh, no. I think with you being a fairly interesting hero, you're also going to get an interesting fleet. No, no, just, please don't. Why, 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 why? 
planet. Oh no, not the funny planet. Unit canceled. Oh my goodness gracious. The only way to defeat those fleets is if we do it on home turf. And frankly speaking, I think we're about to. <laughs> Construction complete. Construction complete. Uh, Let's move on. Uh, give me some eyes on that. I'm gonna have eyes already. Oh no. How big is that fleet? Eight munificence. One providence. Okay, we're dead. We're dead. Construction complete. Tactical battle imminent. System lost. They're pulling out forces from other locations, so we're gonna start picking them off there. Tactical battle imminent. Oh crap. Oh. This place again. Hey, would you look at that? Didn't know I created a space station, but you know what? Uh, happy that I did. I'm, I'm happy I did. Because that's Training troops. pretty rad. Training troops. This is kind of insignificant, actually. I don't know why I... We're going to try to pick them off as much as we can. They're going to try to retreat. Sir. Right away, sir. But we won't Ready let them, right? In progress. We want to take the big one out. Go for the big boy. Brilliant. I wasted all that money, but amazing. Guys, we did it. We did it. Okay. Let's go. Calculating trajectory. Tactical battle imminent. Okay. Providence. How big is that? Oh, ho, 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 looks a little big. Okay. This time, we're doing things a little bit differently. We're going to do a hit and run. Me? No, no. The day won't come when the droid army cannot fight us without a 10 to 1 advantage. I am going to send Anakin over. Copy that. Look, sir. Droids. Here we go. Okay. Come after me. Come after me. Come on now. This should be interesting. Are those guys really gonna huddle? Here's where the fun begins. I can do this blindfolded. Will not fail. Perfect. Yes, Let's yes, go. yes, yes. This should be Choose your reinforcements. We shall arrive shortly. Trajectory plotted. We'll get there, sir. Small portion of the fleet coming in. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, those guys came out of nowhere. So they're gonna think. The AI, yeah, I know the AI thinks. The AI is gonna think that this is our entire fleet composition. I'm going to try to trick them into coming over here, if I can. Come on now. I can pick them off. No, 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 patience, patience. Let me handle this. Copy that. Let me handle this. Okay. I'm going to chase you down, come on. There we go. Choose your reinforcements. And now you've fallen for the ruse. Congratulations. Alright. What are you... What are you... Oh, wow. I didn't even know there was a thing. Didn't know there was there. Alright. Well, the... Who are you? Gold Squadron. Two pairs of folding air bows with this versatile add a maneuverability. What are you? Ah, very cool. All right, all right. That's pretty rad. Get a few new ships in here. That's fantastic. I am going to want the ships to kind of pull it back a little bit. You know what I mean? Like tone it down, guys. Tone it down. Anakin's got this. Yeah, a little bit. We need to thin out the crowd. Oh, Gold Squadron's dead. Sorry, Gold. Guys, don't die. <laughs> okay. 
not get distracted here. I need all fighters. Pull back. Yeah, you're going to fight the thing that kills you, but these guys are going to kill you too. Okay. Okay. And again, pull back. Uh, Soka this time. Okay, so while he bothers them, I'm going to start slowly inching my way forward. Look at this. I think it's because the, the targeting on the Jedi fighters is kind of funky. Like, it, it's not right. So they're shooting in the wrong spot or something's up with that. I think it's cool. I think it's really awesome, but... If I were the Separatist, I'd be kind of confused. <laughs> but yeah. We got level 3. Okay. Nice job, guys. They're literally tanking this entire... Just like in the show, this is extremely... Did you know that this is... Yes, it is extremely canon accurate. I didn't either, but it is because the protagonists are absolutely destroying the heck out of the enemy. Oh, there goes Ahsoka. Get out of there. Look, and they just, they pull back fast. Yeah, you do. It's crazy. Now, if I remember, the Architons has quite the range. Okay. So while he's kind of pestering them, time to see if we can bring him back. Come on. <laughs> Look at those missiles. Nice. Pull back the fighters. Hang on there. Not yet. Not time for the full battle yet. So a lot of this campaign is going to be me kind of just playing around with this. Okay, okay, okay. It's kind of loud. Okay. Venators have always been incredibly powerful in this mod. It, it sometimes may be a, a little bit overpowered, but <laughs> Anakin is also a little bit overpowered. Look at that. <laughs> Dude swarmed. Anakin's distracting them. If we can start damaging the space station a little bit. Okay, where's my support fleet? I need you right here. What do I need like these fighters aren't really urgent, like it's not it's not that they're not that dangerous, but it is important that we make sure that we keep them off Ilarn. Or any of our guys. The bombers in particular. Okay, I will send in our fighter swarm once we get rid of theirs. But look at this. Beautiful. Fantastic. A very, very cannon fleet. Three Vanitors. Absolutely blasting it. A couple Architons. And, uh, 
Couple frigates. Pretty much every ship blasting full cannons, full throttle. And Yularen is doomed. Okay. I didn't even notice. We can't really pull them back. Pull them back, we start showing off their weak points, unfortunately. That's kind of the issue with pulling our troops back. So what I am going to do is I'm going to start committing. So I'm going to send in my fighter wave now. I want you to shield him. Use use your armor. <laughs> shield you learn if you can. I think he is literally doomed, but there he goes. He might be dead, but he stays with our hearts. And he'll be back, I hope. Christ, if they don't come back, this will be a sad campaign. Looks like Anakin did take a little bit of fire. Same with Ahsoka. What's going on here? Would you look at that? We are we are presumably quite Gucci. Incredible. All right. Look at that bombing room. Fighters, don't go there. What are you doing? Why are you spinning that way? What are you doing? No, you are not. Take care. <laughs> Enjoy the sabbatical. You too, actually. I'm gonna have you pull back. We can handle this. The guy's gonna handle this. God, that is just incredible. What terrible shots! <laughs> Goodness. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, oh my gosh, that was fast. There we go. Oh, thank God. Okay, so he is coming back. He will be back. <laughs> Brother Bear. Oh, that one's gone. Okay. I'm getting hyper focused here. I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> All right. We're going to do this battle, and then we'll call it for now. We have no armor. Obi Wan, I, I hope you do okay, because you have zero armor. You can take the ATRTs. <laughs> Here you go, I give to you. We'll just, I guess, take more 501. And we will get more ATRTs wherever I put the. Oh no. Okay. Constructing. Constructing. Beginning construction. Building under construction. Well, there you go, now we're not going to worry about ATRTs again. Of course. Of course, we needed armor. 
Don't worry. I've always got a strategy in mind. This one, this time. Surrender. I'm on my way. Okay. Yes, you are. Receiving coordinates, General. Right away, General. That's how we'll win this war. One battle at a time. That's right. Cody's here too. Perfect. And and another clone. Okay, you got it. All right. Our position is secure. Okay, start scouting ahead, fellas. Oh, hey, more clones. Hey, flex troops. Let's go. All right. Got to put them here. We'll bring the two twelfth specialists. You know, the ones with two twelfth markings. After we get this point. This battle isn't over until we've scrapped the way Nope, and here we go. One shot, one kill. We've got armor. I sense something. What's our We're gonna pull back. Pull back, pull back. We cannot fight armor. Okay. Right away, General. I guess right we'll away, bring the two twelve now. I probably should have put another anti-vehicle, but I wasn't thinking. The droid army would be nothing without superior numbers. What are we waiting? All right, fellas. Would you look at that? Here we go. <laughs> oh, this is just depressing. This is this immediately turned into a defense, not an assault. But perfect, look at that. Our ATRTs. Oh, you actually got it. Oh, not good. Move out, men. We're ready for battle, sir. Choose your Any other troops? I'm surprised you can go up to 16 on the land forces. Okay, okay. This will be our second, second squad here. Okay, here's the plan. We are grabbing Normie troops, Tango Company. You move in here. Except one Plex squad. They're gonna stick with those ATRTs. Okay, that ATRT, I guess. One's gone now. Okay, you get two ATRTs. <laughs> oh, nice. Fantastic. We need that. Are you? Oh no 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 no! Why? Right away, sir. Nothing's deadlier than a clone behind the trigger. Okay, here we go. Now that is a, that is a. Oh my! That is a gun right there. All right, I'll take that. We're going to use the rest of the troops to perform the actual assault. Well, I don't know. <laughs> Perhaps it's because they have put up... Yes, you do. Perhaps it's because they put up quite the good first assault. And they did. Indeed. Okay. Hold this position! Oh, this is so... Mm, okay. Let's go. We're moving in. Can't do anything else but do a two-pronged attack. Why is the medic leading? He's healing himself, though. Hey, yo. Alright, Obi-Wan. Not bad. All right. Bring up the rest. Let's go get them, boys. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Never give up. Losing is not an yes. option. Oh, 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 everybody, 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 everybody. Oh, and there goes our medic. Clone 
Okay, all that's happening. Like chaos. We're bringing in the shinies. Ooh, I think shiny down. I don't think the general would approve. I'm proud to serve you, general. Right away, general. The only good clanker is a wrecked clanker. Take out the super battle droids. ATRTs, come on now. Oh, yeah, they're shiny, all right. Our position is secure. Understood, sir. Get up that ridge, get up that ridge. Unfortunately for this mod, um, being on the same plane is very important. So at this ridge, you don't want to be at the bottom of the staircase, or else your shots won't count. So, let's go. Be mindful, we haven't won yet. Never surrender. No time for souvenirs. Let's move. This is why I like to work alone. One shot. Oh, amazing. Yes. Good job, man. We've secured. System conquered. Beginning construction. And there we go. Obi-Wan just took the place. And that was our first playthrough of our canon Republic at War Plus Clone Wars 4.0 Empire, <laughs> Empire War Forces of Corruption mod. I think it's pretty fun. I am a little bit quiet today. I apologize. But uh, let's, let's try this again, shall we? Or let's continue with our session the next time. But until then, peace.